Where were you last week? Hey, Anna. I've been dying to ask you, where were you last week? Oh my gosh, Sarah. You won't believe what happened. I went on the most amazing vacation. No way. Where did you go? I went to Bali. Bali? That sounds incredible. Tell me everything. Well, it all started when I decided to take some time off work. I needed a break, you know? So, I booked a flight and off I went. The moment I arrived, I was blown away by the beauty of the place. I can only imagine. What were the highlights of your trip? Oh, there were so many. I explored the stunning beaches, experienced the rich culture, and indulged in the most delicious local cuisine. The people there were incredibly friendly too. That sounds like a dream come true. Did you do any adventurous activities? Absolutely. I went snorkeling and saw the most vibrant coral reefs. I also hiked up a volcano at sunrise, which was beyond breathtaking. Wow, Anna. That sounds like an epic adventure. I'm so happy for you. Make yourself at home. Hey, Lisa. Welcome to my new apartment. Make yourself at home. Thank you, Sarah. Congrats on the new place. It looks amazing. Thanks, Lisa. I've been working hard to make it cozy. So, have you bought all the household appliances? Yep. I made a list and got most of them already. It was quite an adventure. Tell me more. What did you get? Okay, first off, check out the fridge. It's huge and has all these cool features. Look at this display. Wow, Sarah. That's such a smart fridge. I'm officially jealous. I couldn't resist. And you know I love cooking. Speaking of which, I got a new oven too. It's sleek and has different presets for baking, grilling, and more. That's fantastic. No more burnt cookies, huh? Exactly. And funny you mention cookies because I also got a dishwasher. No more endless piles of dirty dishes. Well, aren't you fancy now? I'm seriously considering moving in here with you. Hey, the offer is always open. Now, let me show you my pride and joy the smart TV. It's huge, high definition, and has all the streaming services you can imagine. Sarah, this place is amazing. It's like you've turned it into a futuristic dream home. I'm so excited. Oh, Leo, today I have my first day with my crush. I'm so excited. That's great, John. Good luck. So, where are you taking her? Well, I know her favorite restaurant, so I've reserved a table there. I thought it would be the perfect place for our first date. Wow, John. That's impressive. She'll definitely be impressed with your thoughtfulness. I hope so, Leo. I've been listening carefully whenever she talks about her favorite places, and that restaurant always comes up. I thought it would be a nice surprise for her. That's a great approach, John. Showing that you've been paying attention to her interests will make her feel special. Exactly! I really want our first date to be memorable. I want her to feel like she's the most important person in the world tonight. I'm sure she will, John. You've put a lot of thought into this, and it shows. Just be yourself and enjoy the evening. I have a feeling it's going to be amazing. Is she your girlfriend? Hey, John. Is she your girlfriend? No, no. She's actually my friend's sister. Really? So what are you doing with her? 
Well, her brother asked me to help her with some shopping. Apparently, she bought a ton of stuff and wants me to carry it for her. You're a good friend, man. So, are you going to do it? Yeah, I guess so. I mean, I owe her brother a favor anyway. Ah, so that's the real reason, huh? You just want to impress her brother. No, not at all. I just want to help her out. She's actually a really nice girl. Aha, uh -huh, sure. Well, I hope your back can handle all those bags, buddy. Hey now, no need to doubt my strength. I'd been hitting the gym, you know. Can you give me a hand? Hey, sweetie, can you give me a hand? What do you need this time, mom? I just need some help tidying up this room. It's becoming a disaster zone. Fine. But I hope it's quick. Thank you, dear. You're a lifesaver. How does this room get so messy all the time? I know, right? It's like things just magically appear out of thin air. More like you're a secret magician, mom. If only being magic also included cleaning up after myself. Seriously, though, we should all make a habit of cleaning up after we're done using something. I completely agree. It's just so easy to put things off until later, and then it becomes overwhelming. Kind of like what happened here. Exactly. And that's where teamwork comes in. Thank you for helping me out. No problem, Mom. Just don't forget this favor when I need help with something. Deal. You can always count on me. I'll be your cleanup partner anytime. Wow, it actually feels good to have a clean space. See? It's worth the effort. We should celebrate our victory with some ice cream. Yes! Now you're speaking my language! I really need to ace this one. Hey, Emma. Are you all right? You look exhausted. Oh. Hey Lisa. Yeah, I didn't sleep well last night. Oh no, what happened? Are you feeling sick? No, it's just that I was up all night studying for the final next week. I really need to ace this one. Wow, that sounds intense. But Emma, you can't sacrifice your sleep like that. I know, I know, but I just want to make sure I'm fully prepared. I don't want to let the stress get to me. I understand that, but getting enough rest is important for your well-being too, you know? You're right, Lisa. I'm just so worried about this exam. I feel like I need to constantly study and revise to feel confident. I get it, it's natural to be anxious before a big test. But remember, taking care of yourself is equally important. Your brain needs rest to function properly. I guess you're right. It's just hard to find a balance between studying and self-care especially with everything going on. Absolutely, it can be challenging. Maybe you could try setting a study schedule that allows for breaks in relaxation time too. That way you'll be more productive and still have time to recharge. That's a great idea, Lisa. I'll definitely give it a try. It's important to take care of myself during this stressful time. Exactly. And remember, I'm here for you if you need any help or just someone to talk to. We're in this together. Thanks, Lisa. I really appreciate your support. It means a lot to me. Of course, anytime. We're friends and friends look out for each other. Now let's grab a coffee and recharge together during our break. Sounds like a plan. Let's go. Oh.